Hello everyone, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, I'm Maddie. I'm a K-5 STEM teacher and ed tech coach from Los Angeles. I post weekly tech tutorials for teachers and in today's video, I'm going to be sharing how to add and manage bookmarks in Google Chrome. So without further ado, let's get started. opened up Google Chrome on my computer and the very first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to add a bookmark. So first I'll visit the website that I want to bookmark. I'll type it into the URL bar and then if I look all the way onto the right hand side you'll see that there is a star in this URL bar. If I hover my mouse over the star you'll see that it says bookmark this tab. So if I click that star, it can actually add this website as a bookmark to Google Chrome. So once I press add bookmark, you'll see that now I have the option to type in a name. For me, it autofills with the name of my website, but if you wanna change this name and make it a little bit different or make it more obvious for you, you can type in something else. So I'm gonna type in my website, and then the next thing that you'll notice underneath is it says folder. Now we're gonna ignore this folder for right now. In just a little bit, I'm gonna show you how to create folders in Google Chrome. So now I'm gonna go ahead and press the done button and you'll see, if we look up at this bookmarks bar, you'll see that I have three bookmarks right now. I have my calendar, my YouTube channel, and my website, which we just added together. Now we're gonna take a look at these bookmarks in the bookmarks manager. So if I go up to the top of my screen and I press bookmarks, then I will click on bookmark manager. This is where you can manage your bookmarks in Google Chrome. So the first thing I want to show you in this bookmarks manager is how to change the order of your bookmarks. So if I click on my website, I can click and drag to change the location of the bookmark, to change the order. So if you now look at the bookmarks bar at the top of the screen, you'll see that it says my website calendar YouTube channel. So because I have changed the order in this bookmarks manager, it has made the adjustment to the bookmarks bar for me. Now another thing I wanna show you is how to actually edit one of your bookmarks. So if I go and click on the three dots on the right hand side of my bookmark on the bookmarks manager where it says more actions, you'll see that I have the ability to edit. Now there are several other features here. I don't use any of these other features really ever except for delete. So we're just gonna focus on edit. So if I click on edit, you'll see it just allows me to change the name or change the URL of the bookmark. One thing that I think is really cool is that if you delete my website and have there be no text and then you press save, you'll see that now if we look at that bookmarks tab or that bookmarks bar, you'll see that just the icon is saved in the bookmarks bar. So it just has the logo for my website instead of the text that previously said my website. Some people really like this because it allows for kind of a cleaner look in your bookmarks bar. But for me personally, I like to have the text there because it's just easier for me to keep track of what is what. So to edit that again, I'll go back to the three dots. I'll press edit and I'll type in my website. Then I'll press save. Now let's say that I don't want my calendar to be a bookmark anymore. The way I would delete this is I would go over to the right hand side, click on the three dots and then press delete. Now you'll see that my calendar is no longer a part of my bookmarks. The next thing we're gonna take a look at is how to create bookmark folders. On the right hand side, the right hand corner of the bookmarks manager, you'll see that there's another three dot menu. If I click on that, you'll see that there's an option to add a new folder. If I click add new folder, let's say I wanna create a folder of bookmarks for all things related to EdTech Classroom. So my website and my YouTube channel. I can type in give it a name. So let's say I want to just call it EdTech Classroom. Then I can press save and you'll see that I have a folder here and that folder is now a part of my bookmarks bar as well as my bookmarks manager. So what I can do is I can drag and drop these bookmarks into the folder. So now at the top in my bookmarks manager, I have a folder that has all of those bookmarks inside of it. So this can be a really helpful organizational tip, just like how you have folders on your computer or you have folders in Google Drive, folders in Google Chrome for your bookmarks function the exact same way. 
So if I click on this folder, you'll see that there's now a drop down menu with both of the bookmarks that are saved in that folder. So if I wanted to go back and visit my website, I could have the ability to do that. Now I'm going to show you how another way to unbookmark this website. So of course I just showed you how to delete it, but if you're actually on that website, you can also unbookmark it by going to the URL bar on the right hand side and clicking on the star, pressing edit, and then pressing remove. So now this is no longer a bookmark in my bookmarks bar or in my bookmarks manager. You'll see it's no longer in that folder. Now, let's say I want to be on a website and now that I've created my folders already, I want to add that bookmark to the folder. So now what we will do is we will click on that star again to add the bookmark. We'll press add bookmark. And now what we can do is you'll see that there's an option with this drop down menu for the folder. So I can click on the drop down menu and I can choose whether or not I want it to be in a folder. The folder names will appear here or if I want it to be in the bookmarks bar. So let's say I wanted this to be in the folder. I would make sure the folder is selected. Again, I could give it a name and then when I'm ready, I can press done. And so now this bookmark has been saved directly into the folder. Now there's one other way that you can add bookmarks and that's by going to bookmarks and then bookmark this tab. Personally, for me as a user of Google Chrome, I find it a lot easier just to press the star in the URL bar. However, you do have the ability to add a bookmark by pressing bookmarks, bookmark this tab. Now the very last thing that I want to show is how to make this bookmarks bar appear. Mine is here because I've set my view settings so that you can see my bookmarks at all times. The way I did this was I clicked on view and I clicked, clicked the option that says always show bookmarks bar. If I unchecked this, you'll see that my bookmarks bar has now disappeared. So if I want to add it back, I just go to view always show bookmarks bar. Thank you so much for watching today's video all about how to add and manage bookmarks in Google Chrome. If you liked this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already. I post weekly tech tutorials for teachers and I'll see you back here soon. Bye friends.